Hey, welcome to Life with Colonel Lee. Let's take a look at my new swag from 23.0. This is an Australian product. Very cool. So I wanted a, a canvas tent small enough to fit on my Teton Adventurer cot. And there were two swag tents I was looking at. Uh, the first one was a Kodiak canvas swag. And uh, that was originally the one I was gonna go with until I ran across this one. And uh, <clears throat> so the main reason I went with the 23-0 over the Kodiak canvas is this one is self-supporting. So by that I mean the Kodiak canvas, you have to stake it out and guy it out with the guy ropes to hold the tent you know, up, hold its form. This one you don't have to do that with. Uh, it has two uh, aluminum poles at the end to hold the ends up and then to erect the tent without guy lines it has a ridge pole and it's a telescoping pole with a locking lever so once you get it tightened out the tension that you need you lock the lever <clears throat> so now the tent is uh, self-standing freestanding and uh, also this tent here offers a little bit more room inside so you can see I'm sitting up and my head is a little bit taller than the tent, but I can, when I'm in here in a pinch, I can crouch in a sitting, crouch sitting position to be able to uh, adjust my ventilation uh, flaps at each end. <clears throat> and it's a little bit wider than the Kodiak canvas and a little bit taller. So it just felt a little roomier. And the main thing is I don't have to guy the Kodiak canvas out while it's on the cot. I do have the two guy lines for the uh, window awnings, the two end window awnings. I do have that uh, guide to the truck at each end. That was just because yesterday the wind was blowing pretty good and I didn't want a gust of wind to blow it out of the truck. So that was just he holding it down to the cot, to the bed of the truck. <clears throat> So that's the main reason why I got this tent is I want to be able to put it on my cot. And there's times where I'm pulling a trailer with my side-by-side -side or something, doing a side-by-side -side trip. And a lot of times it's just real easy just to set something up in the bed of the truck. And it doesn't take very long to set up this cot. It doesn't take very long to set up this tent. And you have a nice, very comfortable uh, camping setup here in the bed of your truck uh, makes it really nice uh, <clears throat> if the ground is wet soggy you know your hot feet can sink down in the mud and kind of you know you could tilt over <laughs> anyway it's just a nice flat surface just a clean area to kind of set up your camp here so it is a nice heavy duty canvas material and it does have a pvc floor so it's kind of a rubbery uh no, it's kind of like a rubber mat for the floor of it, so it's very waterproof. And the mattress, that was another thing. The mattress on the 23-0 was a little bit thicker than the one uh, the Kodiak Canvas offered. The Kodiak Canvas swag was 2.5, this one's 2.75. A little bit bigger, it's very comfortable. So I did test this out last night and uh, it got pretty cold. So I think the low was 33 with the wind chill, it felt like 29. It was very warm in here and I just needed my, I think this is rated for 30 degrees down quilt and it was very toasty, very warm. I like being able to close up the end windows and then the doors and then the, everything that's openable does have the, does have the bug screen. And so the two end windows they're pretty large and you are able to open the bug mesh on those as well. So you can reach out, uh, grab some things if you need to, set something out there, whatever. It's just very handy, very, it's a very interesting tent. All right, well, thanks for stopping by and checking out this uh, 23-0 swag tent. 